Hi everyone, my name's Anne-Marie. Welcome to a new episode of Cook TV brought to you by www.craftshoeprint.com Today we're going to look at a gorgeous kit from Sandy Birchall and the cup number is cup 108-6863-425 It's called Birdhouse 13 and it's a shaped card mini kit you get three sheets in the kit, there's lots of decoupage and lots of sentiment and it measures approximately 7.5 by 5.5 inches when it's made. I'd like to run through everything that you get in the kit and then we'll go ahead and make the card. So the first thing that there is, is the kit front and this just shows how it looks when it's made and the insert that's included as well. The next sheet, well the first of the sheets that we're going to use is this is the card front and the back of the card. Sandy's included some sentiments and she's included the instructions of where to score for making the actual card. The next sheet is the insert sheet. Again, Sandy's included where you score and where you're going to put the glue tab to insert the insert into the card. And the last sheet is lots of gorgeous decoupage for your birdhouse. Again, lots more sentiment. And Sandy has designed it in such a way that she's included the step-by-step -step A, B, C, etc. as it goes to layer up the decoupage just to help you. Now, the first thing that I've done is I've cut out the front of the birdhouse and the back of the birdhouse. I've already scored along the line as it instructs me on the sheet and I've got tape just at the top that I'm just going to peel off. So it's flat double sided adhesive tape and then what happens is we're going to attach the top of the birdhouse to the base of the birdhouse. I'm just going to turn it slightly so that I can see and we're just simply marrying up the corner and the design to create the card like so. And that's where the score line at the back helps. So we can open that up and then put that to one side because I've cut out the two insert pieces. I've scored along the tab line and I've added red tape. So what I'm going to do is peel off the top of the red tape and then add the opposite side of the insert to the other insert, so I'm marrying them both up and then I'm simply going to just turn the tab over at the top to glue the two pieces together to create the insert. I'm then going to go back to the actual card itself. Now I've added a little bit of tape on the back of the insert just to hold it in place so I can peel the back of the tape away and I'm just going to add the insert into the card and just peel that off slightly because it's stuck to itself straight away so we'll just straighten that up a little bit and pop it in and fold the front over like so. So we've got our insert. Now what you can do is add a little bit of adhesive on this side. I'm just going to use an adhesive runner just to attach it to the front of the birdhouse so that when you open it, it opens and shows both sides of the insert. Then 
we can go ahead and start adding our decoupage. So the first piece of decoupage is the roof of the birdhouse. I just simply had that on 3D foam. And the second part of the birdhouse at the bottom, again, on 3D foam. So we can just add that. Then we can start building up our beautiful bird in the centre. So I've cut out the first layer, 3D foam on the back. And I can marry up the image and pop that down, press it down, there we go. Our next layer of the bird, again, 3D foam on the back, marry up the image. Each layer is slightly smaller than the previous layer to get that gorgeous decoupage effect. Our next layer of the bird, again on 3D foam, slightly smaller again, marrying up the design. And then the last layer of the bird, smaller again, just the body of the bird mainly, and marrying the design up. And last but not least, I've chosen a sentiment that says just for you, so it's suitable for so many different occasions. I've got 3D foam on the back and I'm just going to pop it over the little label at the bottom. And that is our beautiful birdcage, birdhouse card finished. We've got our insert that you can write your message and your name from. And it's just such a beautiful card. I'd like to remind you of the cup number. It's cup 108 six eight six three underscore four two five and you can see any of sandy's designs by looking for sandy birchall on the craft shoe print website i would just like to say thank you so much for watching and i shall see you next time